The trailblazing women being inducted this year into the International Tennis Hall of Fame. Billie Jean King, part of a group who challenged the wide pay disparity between men and women. ESPN's Elle Duncan is here with more on this story and such a cool story of accomplishment for these women. It certainly is, and I love being able to join you all here on GMA and talk about my full-time job, something mm -hmm. sport-related. But Eva, at the time, women in tennis, in many cases, were being paid 12th of what the men were making to play the exact same sport. So fed up, Billie Jean King and the original nine made a bold move to break free from the tennis establishment and form what would now become the WTA. Fed up with rampant gender discrimination in tennis at the time, nine women, led by Hall of Famer Billie Jean King, made a revolutionary decision in 1970 that's finally being commemorated in the National Tennis Hall of Fame. And ahead of their induction later today, I chatted with seven of the original nine women to reflect on their enduring legacy almost 51 years later. Remind people what you all were facing that led you to form your own tour. Well, we had no money. So they were giving us very limited money. And so we want it to be you know, equal and to have a place. Uh, and at that time, you know, we had the women's movement too. So we were a part of that. And there's three things that we end up talking about. Number one is any girl born in this world, if she's good enough, would finally have a place to compete. Number two, that she or we would be appreciated for our accomplishments, not only our looks, because everything was about looks in. And number three, the most important one, obviously, is to be able to make a living playing the sport we love and had a passion for. And that's what we wanted for every girl that came after us. Now, realizing that dream meant a grassroots approach with the women serving as promoter, publicist, and salesperson, typically at the detriment of their craft. So when we love each other, we care about each other, but together we did this. And uh, relationships are everything. And I just, you know, we're all friends, and that's what really what matters. Here they are. The impact of the original Nine's decision reverberates throughout tennis to this day, as female tennis players are now among some of the highest paid athletes in the world. It's been over 50 years. What part of your journey do you hope endures? The fact that we were willing to stand up, to do right, to risk everything. There was also the truth, there wasn't much left for us. We had to band together and we had enough people with the guts and the understanding of the importance of what we were doing. What we did is we showed up, we stood up, and we spoke up. Oh, I love that. Showed up, stood up, spoke out, and they did it, of course, together. They talked a lot about togetherness. Billie Jean said she hopes that their experience proves that women are a powerful force when they work together. And while they say there's a lot more work to be done, they feel a lot of satisfaction and really an overwhelming sense of pride with the sacrifice that they made for the cause. Their official induction will be happening a little later today at the National Tennis Hall of Fame. Amazing. Mm -hmm. It's so cool what they did because you look at what women are paid in other sports and the disparities still exist yeah, in the fight tennis still continues. because of what these women did. Exactly. Their advice to the women like the women's national soccer team who are still fighting mm -hmm. for those kinds of things was to be bold and make sure that you hold them to it, hold them accountable. Yeah, incredible. And the impact is huge. It's, no. it's felt to this very day. It is. Yes. Well, hey there, GMA fans. Robin Roberts here. Thanks for checking out our YouTube channel. Lots of great stuff here. So go on, click the subscribe button right over, right over here to get more of awesome videos and content from GMA every day, anytime. We thank you for watching, and we'll see you in the morning on GMA.